Now you're going to die. What is up YouTube, it's your boy DC5 Rapage here and today I'm bringing you a gameplay on Village where I go 50 and 5 in the domination, the lubrication, the penetration and the masturbation. Can I get your persuasion? The thumbs is up, not jokes, I'm not going to ask for a like, but yeah anyway this is a gameplay on the map Village and guys I really love this freaking map. I failed a predator so hard there, I never hardly fail predators but I failed that one. But to be honest guys, this is becoming one of my favourite maps, uh, it has ever since we first started um, playing Modern Warfare 3. Generally because it's an open map, your kill streaks can actually do work, and um, you know, there's not that many buildings that people can bitch camp in, and yeah, I picked up a sniper rifle, you know, I wonder if I, I can't even remember if I get any quick scopes, I doubt it though, because I'm, I'm not a good quick scoper, but yeah, um, yeah, about this map, an open map, so, when, like, map packs are supposed to be coming uh, later this month, January 24th, 25th, 26th, somewhere along them, them lines, alright? I'm really hoping for some open maps, sort of like Village, Mission, things like that, and, like, maybe another small map like Dome or something like that, because, I don't know, I just find it a lot more entertaining, and to be able to use kill streaks, like, I get sick of using specials, like, to be honest, like, you feel really good when you're doing it, look at this, playing a bit of cat and mouse with this guy. <laughs> and here he's there. Look, pull oh, the cancel my reload. Fuck, I don't know if I die here. Yeah, I fucking died. Oh well. But, um, yeah, what was I saying? Oh, uh, about the map packs and stuff. So, yeah, I hope they got some sort of small maps because, I don't know, it's, I'm sorry, yeah, that's what I was talking about. The specialist kill streak. So, specialist, um, I don't know, I get sick of using it, you know, it's like, yeah, you feel like a beast, but I don't know, when, if you die, then I don't know. I just like using a soul kill streak. I like, that's why I like Call of Duty because it's really hands on. Um, I like to use kill streaks like the Reaper and stuff. I just like controlling them sort of things. That's probably why, generally, I reckon Call of Duty has become such a popular thing as the introduction of um, kill streaks and stuff. How we can use them just makes it really, really fun. But you know, I'm running and gunning with the Overwatch and the Pave Low. Look at this guy. Look at this gift. What are these guys doing, man? They're fucking having a tea party, having some scones and fucking tea or something. I don't know, make me a cup, I want two sugars, milk, and a warm glass of shut the fuck up. Alright, anyway. So, yeah, I'm running and gunning. I love using the Overwatch and the Payblow. Overwatch and the Payblow combo is just such a good um, SMG sort of class. So, if you guys want, like running SMGs, I don't know, I like feeling like super lightweight and shit when I'm running um, SMGs. So, I don't know, I like to run and gun a lot. So, I like to use the Predator because the Predator always leads me to my next skill streak, which will either be the Reaper or the Overwatch. And look, I'm looking down there again to see if anyone's there. But yeah, I did not notice that. Look, I thought I saw something and look, and I died. <laughs> what the fuck? Anyway, yeah, um, a good running and gunning class would be the Predator because it normally leads me to my um, Overwatch and then would lead me to like my Pavlo or something when you're getting right in that spawn and you don't have to stop running, keep getting all those kills and. I don't know, all those guys, look at this nade. If you guys didn't know those nade spots, take note of all my nade spots. I've got, I, I hit a triple today, uh, from B to A again, um, and then I got a, a predator, that was sick. But um, yeah, anyway, I'm getting off topic here, but um, yeah, running and gunning, I don't know, it's, I, I really like running and gunning, and I find that's like the best, like, sort of setup for me. I don't know, what do you guys, what's your best running and gunning setup? Look at me trying to fucking quick scope, I'm a nugget, look. Oh, I got a quick scope. What? What? I never get quick scopes. Come on. This game's too easy. If I can get a quick scope, this game is just F in the A, if you know what I'm saying, man. Because, I don't know. In Black Ops, I was like pretty. I was okay, but there was a lot of skill required. In Modern Warfare 3, I, like, I hit marked this guy with a shotgun like three times to the face. And you know what he did? He turned around and quick scoped me. Now, how the fuck does that work? Honestly. How does it work when someone can just get three hit markers to the face with a shotgun and turn around, do a little 180, quick scope? Oh my fucking god, and then this game is ridiculous sometimes. Like I love this game, but it's just fucking ridiculous sometimes. The things that they come up with, like death streaks, man. Infinity Ward make games for noobs. I'm sad to say it, but I like I'm I like MW3, but there's just some bullshit shit that they got in this game, man. Like Death streaks, right? Dead man's hand. This game is made for noobs. It's this game is helping noobs. 
That's what it is. That's all it is. This game is here to make noobs sell more copies because they're having fun at playing this game. See, like, Treyarch and Black Ops and World at War and stuff like that, they made games for gamers. Now, a lot of commentators say this, and that's because it's true, because you don't get bullshitted a lot. Like, sure, you had Second Chance, but I played Black Ops the other day, and Second Chance has nothing on fucking Dead Man's hand. You put a guy into Last Stand, like, in Black Ops uh, Second Chance, you used to get, um, you know, you would get the kill for it. Now you get a fucking assist, and this guy can fucking use, like, this bomb, C4. <laughs> it's just ridiculous, man. Like, I've been, like, one away from Pavlo or an Osprey Gunner or something like that. And then I just get shitted on by some guy that's too shit for the game, has Dead Man's hand on just to be a cunt, and I'll fucking die and lose all my kill streaks. Like, honestly, this game, that game, that's not for a gamer. That's for someone. That's so they can sell their thing, because they can sell their product to noobs so they can have a good time using fucking blowing up people and I don't know, all this other bullshit. I don't know, it's just got so much bullshit. Like, Black Ops, I think they got, like, honestly, Black Ops. Sure, it pissed us off. There was oh, Ghost was overused. Second Chance was annoying, but you know what? You could counter those things. The Blackbird that got rid of Ghost. If you had a Blackbird up, you could fucking kill those Ghost corner camping bitches. But in Modern Warfare 3, you got Assassin. Assassin Pro is immune to all that type of shit. Now what the hell? Anyway, this is just my rant on freaking Modern Warfare 3 and Black Ops. But Black Ops, I think, in my opinion, it was a very good game. It was just, it got a bit boring, I don't know why it got boring, but, you know, I, what can you do? Like, games are going to get boring after you play them for a while. Like, I, I get bored of Modern Warfare 3 sometimes, guys, I'm not going to lie, but, I don't know, I just keep playing. There's something addictive to it, but I do get bored, and, yeah, I just like to try and switch it up a little, use Assault, you know, especially if it gets to be boring sometimes to me. Like, going for MOAB is like... To be honest, you can go for MOA Beast. Look at this. Fucking, they're all there again. This is like where they're all having their tea party and shit. What the fuck? Yeah, anyway. um, Yeah, Modern Warfare 3. Getting a bit boring, but overall, you know, fucking, what are you going to do? We have to wait another year. That's about it. Anyway, that's my rant on Modern Warfare 3. I don't know if you guys enjoyed this sort of style of commentary, my opinions and stuff. Yeah, so, I don't know. If you guys want to feel free to rate the video... Um, do so. If you haven't subscribed already, subscribe and follow me on Twitter for some open lobbies and I'll catch all you guys later. Peace.